I couldn't find anything online or on YouTube, any in-depth video reviews of this specific model. So I decided to make this video and also to help those who might be interested. First impression when I first got them is that they are a little bit heavier than my external ones that I have. But just like everything, your body should get used to it. So I'm very excited. I, what drew me to these is the look of them. And it has the mech guard that is required for my work. It starts all the way from here. All the way down. And to here. That's the steel toe. And it comes all the way up. And also, another thought is that it is high quality compared to my other ones that I had. It says here, Everguard abrasion resistant and genuine leather. It has a really cool lacing system. I'm not sure if you can see that right there. These laces are looped in. They can't go anywhere. So if you rip them, you can just slide them through. But yeah, they're meant to stay in. So easy access. And it has a little tag there that's made out of rubber. And here is the information about all the technology that's in it. Later on, I'll have pictures of all these here and all the safety standards there that it meets. It says here, abrasion resistant, heat resistant, slip and oil, and all that stuff. I'm scratching this front and back part right here. And it is scratch proof. As you can see, there's no marks on it so that's nice there's the bottom and the first thing I did was I put these on and it is true to size uh, I ordered my size and it came exactly fits very nice and comfortable and high quality for sure compared to my other one here's the heel it is on the inside. A lot of padding, good ankle support here. This hard part here, it comes all the way up. So that gives a lot of support, I can tell, compared to my other pair. It doesn't have this part right here that's like hard plastic rubber or something, I don't know. But uh, stay tuned for the pictures and my final thoughts about these boots a week from now. Okay everybody, it's been about a month now since I've worn these to work. I've put them through quite a lot of wear and tear. I'm not sure if you can tell because these are non-marking but uh, they're still, they have some scratches and stuff on them. But after a month now, it's been, I've been very happy with these. They're very comfortable. There is a slight rubbing after a while but they tend to go away and come back but it's not a big issue. It's just like a little rubber on rubber uh, when you walk, like a little noise that makes, but not nothing you can actually really tell. But overall, the build quality of these boots are very high <clears throat> and extremely comfortable and high quality. I had a little issue at the very first day uh, with these boots was that for, for uh, these boots to be approved through my work, for them to pay for it, because we're in Canada, 
It should have these two stickers on it. These are my old boots with the external. It should have this sticker and this sticker here uh, in Canada for it to be approved for under Canadian standards. These boots, as you can tell, don't have any. So I was afraid that they weren't, weren't going to pay for them or approve them. But after speaking to the big bosses and handing them, handing them all the standard uh, features, safety uh, features that it meets, they did approve it. So if anyone that's interested in Canada that is worried that you need these two to be approved, th this specific boot covers all of these safety standards that come on these ones. So no worries about that. It is approved through my work. 100% they paid for it so I'm happy so no worries about that so overall I do recommend uh, getting the Timberland Pro uh, 6 inch steel toe um, with the external mech guard the next boot I'm probably gonna buy if these ever you know died or anything or anything goes wrong I'm probably gonna get the same boot but on the 8 inch boots um, I just want to try them maybe they're just a little bit more sturdy but overall I'm very happy with these boots they seem to last a lot longer than these for sure already um, you can't really tell that from just the look of it that I do put them through a lot the stitching is made from Kevlar you see a little bit peeling here but that's you know kind of normal with what I do but um, overall it's a very sturdy boot and I recommend it for anyone that is interested thanks for watching and we'll see you next time